Hi everyone, it's Wednesday, May 15th. It's actually Saturday, May 8th. And you are watching Wednesdays, Saturdays, with Emily on Five Awesome Musicians. My video is four days late. It's been such a busy week that I didn't realize that I had not uploaded my video until Thursday and I feel very bad. It's four days late. So I am going to talk about four different things to make up for the fact that my video is late. I'm so sorry. First off, let's um, keep going on the countdown of Emily's top 90s hip hop hits. Um, we're at number three. We're getting so close to the end of the countdown. I'm going to have to start thinking of something new to count down. I need your help maybe with that. But number three is the Crossroads by Bone Thugs and Harmony. That song is my ringtone for when my mom calls me. <laughs> I don't know why I picked it. I just wanted to use the ringtone and my mom didn't have an assigned ringtone yet, so there you go. Number two, this weekend I went to a concert at Elmhurst College. It was the Varsity Band concert. Um, varsity Band at Elmhurst is basically for students um, who play something other than their first instrument. Um, and so they do a lot of like junior high repertoire. Um, and I went to their concert and I took some video. Um, and they did many different great songs, including uh, I Dreamed a Dream from Les Mis. And Some Nights by the band Fun. Number three, now that the countdown's kind of winding down, I think I'm going to start every week kind of um, showing one of my favorite songs from some obscure musical theater shows or from some different um, composers. Andre, I know you had mentioned that you really wanted singers to start singing other things than Jason Robert Brown and that there's so much more out there. And I totally agree with you. There is so much more. Um, so I kind of want to... Um, just kind of put a song out there for you guys to look at and to listen to and um, yeah, just to give some exposure to some new artists that you may not know of or some songs that you may not know of. This week I want to show you guys um, a song called Avalanche by the writing team of Kerrigan and Loudermilk. This is sung by Lindsay Mendez, so take a look at this. In love, love. crazy good, obviously. The song is really great. It's rangy. I love it. Um, and it's available on their website if you want to, um, if you want to buy it. I bought it for Christmas. Love it. Maybe I'll sing it someday for you guys when I'm not so busy. I don't know. If you're lucky. Number four is twofold. I wanted to share some information with you guys. I know last week I had talked about, um, I had an audition for Legally Blonde, and I wanted to go ahead and let you guys know that I got the role of Paulette Bonafonte again, so this will be my second time playing her. It's at Naperville Summer Place Theater in Naperville, Illinois, if you want to come up and see that. The show is the last weekend of June, and the second weekend in July. We're going to skip the 4th of July weekend. So 
Um, I'm so excited. We've had a week of rehearsal and um, I actually have to be in whipped into shape, not as Paulette, but like as a video person, whatever, I like part of the ensemble. And so I have to learn how to jump rope and it's going okay. And then the other piece of news I want to share with you guys is I was recently elected vice president of concert choir at Elmhurst. Uh, I'm very excited about that. Um, and yeah, so it's going to be a really great year next year. I'm really excited to be on the exec board and do some planning and um, just get a lot of leadership experience too. That's all for me. Um, have a glass of wine because it's actually the weekend so you can fill it up a little bit more. So everyone have a great weekend, and um, if you are going into finals week, good luck. Do well. If you have voice juries on Monday, like I know a lot of you do, good luck with that. Do a lot of memorization, and I will see you guys in like three days when I have another video to put up. So see you guys later. Bye.